What's up, beautiful people? My name is Al, and welcome to my YouTube channel. On today's video, I got a super awesome one for you guys, and it's pretty unique. A subscriber told me about a mansion that is literally right off the beach that could be abandoned or it could have someone living there, but the grass is completely out of control. But let me go ahead and show you how neglected this property is as we talk to the neighbor next door. And guys, let me tell you, every house over here was a mansion. I was kind of intimidated to knock on some neighbor's doors, but for their privacy, I left them out of the video. But let me go ahead and show you this yard. How's it going? I was curious about this house. Is it abandoned or someone lives there? Someone lives here, but I never see him. So I don't know if they're in jail, or if they're somewhere else, or oh, in a halfway okay. house or whatever. She's lived here for decades and yeah. she always makes a lot of mess. I cut abandoned yards and stuff but i saw signs that said yeah no, wildflowers so i was like you can contact the city to see if they'll let you pick up okay. a contract because yeah. i i know brian complains pretty regularly he yeah right next door and that'd be place. nice for you guys you know Hell yeah and like i noticed i noticed <laughs> it's he, pretty bad he usually is the one that complains to the city yeah about it, so. okay yeah someone lives there but i haven't seen her in probably i couldn't tell you last time I've seen oh her. really i knocked on the door when i knocked on the door i seen like some little lights up there so i was like someone might live here i can't tell though it's pretty well, tall yeah it's okay nice. well maybe i'll contact the city and see yeah see what's mess. up with that i was just curious about it because it's like yeah it's a mess it's a mess <laughs> well you have a good one thank you <laughs> you too so the neighbor said they actually never see the person that owns this house she thinks they could be in a halfway house or selling drugs or in jail or something, which is pretty crazy because this is a super nice house. I'm very surprised that it's neglected. She said the other neighbor calls code enforcement on them all the time. They hated how this yard looked. She said I could get in touch with the city, but I think I'm just going to go ahead and cut it anyways. If someone comes out, I'm sure they'll be happy that we mowed the yard. If not, the neighbors will be happy. I know that for sure. It's such a beautiful property right on the beach. I really can't believe they let it get to the shape that it's in right now, but that's what I'm here for. I want to make this intro super short and sweet, so let's get right into the video. But first, guys, my buddy SB Moen and myself, we did a collab on some merch. It's election season right now, and I don't know who you guys are going to vote for, but I know I'm going to vote for SB and Blades because we're making tall grass low. This is actually a limited drop, and when they're gone, we're not restocking. If you guys don't know, Spencer from SB Mowing, go ahead and check him out. He does the same type of work that I do, helping people in need out cutting the craziest yards. Super awesome dude. The merch is dropping on his website, sbmowen.com. I'll leave a link in the description down below of that too. I'm telling you guys, when it's sold out, it's gone for good. And it's a super cool design. Let me know in the comments down below, guys, if you guys would vote for us. Nothing left to do but to get into this crazy property, see what happens. Today's actually my second day on this property. No clue what's in store. I love you guys, and I hope you guys enjoy.
go through batteries fast on this yard. So many bees. I don't know if you guys know this, but when you do palm trees, all the palm fronds they always have bees nests in it. So I came prepared. It ain't gonna happen again.
pretty good chance I'm going to get stung by a wasp today because there's so many palm fronds, this side and that side. But, we'll see how it goes. You know, I like to rush roulette. As long as it's not on my face again.
Stuck on something right here. Stuck on something right here, guys. It's so hot. Can't believe how hot it is. But, but we got pretty stuck. It's real soft right there. Super stuck. Let me go ahead and show you guys the ocean real quick so nice out there. Nice oceanfront property right here. Imagine living at this neighbor's house. That is crazy. But, so, let me tell you what I got going on. It's actually super hot. I'm gonna try to get unstuck, finish this side, and I'm gonna come back tomorrow and finish the rest. But back here, all this seagrass right here, that's all protected and it's illegal to cut that. So I'm gonna go to where this property line is. Then I'm gonna cut that. But what do you guys think about this view? It'd be nice to wake up to that. All right, I'll see how hard this thing is gonna be. All right, I'll see how hard this thing is gonna be to get on stuff.
day two of this property don't got too much left so let's get to it these shirts are going to be on sb mullins website go ahead and check it out let me know what you think let's get back to this yard
me. I got. I 